Hi guys, it's Jack here from Snaprevise to give you my top five tips for effective A-level maths revision. My first tip is to make sure you understand concepts intuitively. It's worth spending the time to make sure you really know what's going on in an equation or in a graph, rather than rote memorizing the steps to complete questions. Rote memorizing steps can work, but it can also leave you confused and frustrated if you're thrown a curveball in the exam. If you take the time to fully understand the concepts, you will have a much easier time applying your knowledge in unexpected contexts, which is what a lot of the high mark questions require. Not to mention, it'll make learning maths way more enjoyable. My second tip is to make posters and stick them around your room. It's easy to forget about topics once you've looked over them. So once you've finished revising a topic, make a poster with all the key information you need to know and stick it somewhere you'll see often. A good idea would be to personalize your poster to suit you. So if, for example, you know you often trip up in one area of a topic, give it more space on the poster and write little notes to yourself as reminders of how to get it right. My third tip is slow and steady wins the race. It's much better to learn the concepts one by one throughout the year than trying to cram them all in at the last minute. A-level maths is a difficult subject, and the ideas you'll learn need time to swirl around in your brain before you'll be able to work with them intuitively. Revision is most useful when you have a solid period of slow and steady learning and practice under your belt. Otherwise, maths can feel far more intimidating and confusing than it needs to be. My fourth tip is to work with friends. Explaining your workings out can be a big help in spotting gaps in your knowledge. One way to do this would be sitting down with a friend and working through a past paper together. Make sure you both explain your reasonings out loud to each other. The best way to be sure you understand something is to try and teach it to someone else. My fifth tip is start with the most fundamental concepts and build upwards. Maths builds on itself. All the fundamental concepts are the bedrock on which the bigger, more challenging concepts rest. Things like solving equations, sketching graphs, differentiation, integration, and trigonometry are important to understand as fully as possible. If you don't know them like the back of your hand, it'll be much harder to move on to the more complicated stuff. Hey guys, I hope you enjoyed the video. If you're looking for an amazing A-level maths resource, join me today in my series of engaging, bite-sized video tutorials. Just click the Snaprevise smiley face and together, let's make A-level maths a walk in the park.